Hey guys, so I ran off the beach real quick, um, thought a quick video might help um, explain what's happening. First and foremost, from my bottom of my heart, look, Joey, nothing more than I want to do to close this loan on Friday. Trust me. I care about you. I have a reputation. I love the fact that you guys are trusting in me. So please know my goal is always to get you closed on time. That we're missing that upsets me too. I know you guys want to get in, get on this house and do everything you can. So please know that's my number one priority. With that being said, I have to explain real quick so you can understand a little bit about my industry. Um, it's not as cut and dry as it used to be, you know. Back in 2008 and 2009, you know, we could submit self-employed income and they would just look at it briefly, see how much you have in assets, see what you, you know, you're paying, see all this stuff and they would just be like, all right, check off, you're good. Well, and again, Joey, this is not on you at all, but I'm just kind of giving you an example. But by the underwriters doing those types of loans, that's what crashed the industry in 2008, 2009. So since then, underwriters, every underwriter, not cross country, this is everywhere, are extremely difficult, okay? And I mean difficult. It's like an airplane ride, it's turbulent, okay? There's gonna be ups and downs, they're gonna see things, they're gonna want more things, they're gonna want this, they're gonna want that, okay? This is every company, this is not ours, okay? This is everywhere. You have good credit, yes, Joey, you have plenty of money. That's not a question, okay? They're not saying you don't, they're not saying that you don't have the ability to repay. But banks require the T's to be crossed, I's to be dotted, or they will not do the loan anymore. An underwriter's job is to protect the lender. They make sure that the loans are good, okay? So the only thing they're saying, buddy, and this is, you know, Jesse, please, I hope you're watching this too, is they know you're good, okay? But we have to be able to prove the documents that we need, meaning we have to be able to show 12 months business bank statements, okay? They were confused, obviously, because most of them just said Joey and Kim. So it looked like a personal bank statement. So think about it. If it's a personal bank statement, it would just be no different than me or Jesse paying our bills, okay? Doesn't look like the business was. Now that we have that letter, I'm hoping that will help, okay? Again, hoping. There's no guarantee, but I'm gonna push it. I'll try to get an exception. I'll go directly to the owner if I have to, okay? As far as everything else, if we only get bits and pieces of it, then the problem is the underwriter's gonna come back and say, nope, I need this. Or if they get something, and they see something in there they don't like or have a question, then they're gonna come back and say, hey, what is this, okay? That's our world today. And it is like that everywhere, all right? The biggest issue is, and it's not an issue, um, it's every self-employed buyer that I've ever seen, is, Joe, you make a lot of money, but at the end of the day, you write everything off. So they're going off of you, you know, what we have to verify is like $3,000 a month. So verifiable income, doesn't look like you could make the payments, okay, on a home. Again, that's just verifiable. Clearly, you make enough money and you pay your bills on time, so they know you can, but an underwriter has to be able to show proof. That's why we added your dad. The debt to income ratio is still right at 50%. It's still very high. That's why I'm having your dad's insurance lowered. That's why we need a profit and loss. There's a lot more to this loan, guys, than what it, you would think, okay? I'm dealing with a high debt to income ratio. I'm dealing with self-employed. I'm dealing with bank statements. There's a lot here. I understand that you want the loan done. Please know that's all I care about. I care about you, Joey, more than you know, okay? I want this loan done. Jesse, I love you, always have, always will. Just please trust me, get us what we're asking for. We will get you into this home and I'll get it done quickly, okay? Let me know of any questions, guys. Thanks.